changed the world. Hello, hello, and welcome back to the world of assassination and the trending contracts. And today's contract, Janus Breakin, set in Whittleton Creek. And the contract ID is up on the screen now for anyone who wishes to have a crack at it and has been supplied to us today, courtesy of Manti Maxus. So on to our briefing, short and sweet, 47, kill Janus and his friends. I think we can manage that. So today we have five targets available to us with no stipulations on how we dispatch them or what we wear whilst we do so but we do have only one exit available to us. So for today's challenge we'll be starting at the default location and we're going to be bringing with us our ever trusty lockpick, a silenced pistol and the Seeker 1 make you sick dart gun in a briefcase. So right from the start and off the bat we are going to make our way directly to the house for sale which is the last house on the right at the end of the street here. Uh, we need an item located in this property and then we need an item that is located in another property backed on to this one I believe. So when we get to the house for sale we will find the keys to the front door just in the plant pot to our right and we can then let ourselves straight in. We're going to head straight to the kitchen and we're going to render the engineer in here unconscious and he will drop a wrench and that is the item we will require. So once we have the wrench, we're going to retrieve our Seeker 1, so we don't forget about that later. Uh, out the back of the property and over the fence into the opposite garden, where there are two gardener-style guards. We're going to make our way right to the corner of the garden, and in the bushes we will find a pack of cigarettes, and we're going to collect them up. So with everything now gathered up, we can approach Janus's property and begin eliminating our targets. Now we're going to go in to Janus's property via the secret passage. So we're going to lockpick the garage door here with the boat outside and then lockpick our way through the basement. I think there's about three doors we have to lockpick our way through. So door number one taken care of, down into the basement in the rehearsal studios, lockpick our way through the door on our right here and then open the secret passage bookcase, feel like James Bond, there we go and through the secret passage and into Janus's property. Now there's uh, one bodyguard located in the basement here. He's luckily just moving away, so we are able to get behind him rather quickly, render him unconscious. We're going to hide his body in the closet provided, and while we're here, we're going to take his outfit. Also, if you so wish, you can take out the surveillance system, which usually I tend to do even if I'm not going to encounter any cameras. Today we will, so it is beneficial to take out the surveillance system. So there is two of our targets, Gunther and Janus, and our other two targets are up on the first floor with our final target just outside the front door to our right. So we're just going to wait for the guard you can see on the right there to move over to the left as he is doing and we can then make our way up the stairs around to the right through the study out the other side and we now have line of sight on both of our first two targets so down with you yes i'm gonna regret this and down with you 
So we need to clean up this area before Janus and Gumpfer arrive. So we're going to drag both of these guys into the small bedroom area where there is a closet provided. Don't forget to collect up the guns as well. Uh, it won't cause a major issue, but it will slow you down somewhat while we wait for someone to clear them away. So it's much easier if we do the job ourselves. So one, and there's the other one. So once that's all done, we're going to make our way into Janus's bedroom. And we're going to place the pack of cigarettes we've collected on the table. And then unloosen the valve on the gas cylinder here with the wrench we've collected. And at this point you can vacate the area. But as we need to remain in the house for our final target, I'm going to wait in the closet in the bedroom so that I get a nice good view of Janus on his flying lesson. So that's three targets taken care of. Now you might get lucky and get Janus as well. Unfortunately for me, we've only rendered him unconscious. So quick bullet to the head. Uh, we'll hide his body as a bullet to the head doesn't count as an accident. And once we've got him dealt with, we can then select our seeker one. We're going to make our way down the stairs, open the front door and shoot the guard guarding the front door in the back with the seeker one. Just be aware of the politician who should be approaching this area around about now. So that guard's going to get sick and he's going to make his way into the downstairs bathroom. I'm just going to wait for the guard in the kitchen who is an enforcer to move away as he is doing now and then we're just going to follow the other guard who is wearing the same outfit as us, that's not on, and we're just going to introduce him to his stomach contents. So have a load of that mate. So once we've dealt with him that is all of our targets now dealt with. All that's left for us to do is to make good our escape. We're going to head straight out the front door and around Mrs. West's house to our one and only exit, which is thankfully also the nearest safe exit, and that is the bus stop. So there we go, one more trending contract taken care of. Uh, quite an enjoyable one, although the targets do tend to pop up quite a lot in other contracts but that doesn't matter that just means that I'm well versed in how to eliminate them so we just get confirmation all of our targets have been eliminated according to plan and we've met our objective no one saw us commit any crimes so we get our silent assassin rating I have been Anubis and I will see you all in the next video.